So after wrapping up our 30 for 30 sunscreen challenge, and after the whole Nivea UV super water gel saga, we kept getting this sunscreen request. I'm guessing because of potential texture similarities. Let's give it a shot. Today, let the chemist test Roto's Skin Aqua Super Moisture UV Gel SPF 50 plus. Y'all are definitely spot on. This texture has a very light, watery break and an incredibly clean texture. I got the pump bottle, so it's slightly more challenging to do the two to three finger rule. Two fingers worth of blobs felt right to me here. I will say in the beginning, I was slightly nervous because we still ran into some of that same streaking effect where it didn't seem to want to absorb initially, but after a little more rubbing, I could actually get a uniform film. Thank God. It's been hot in LA. Let's make it even hotter and put this through a sweat test via a hot yoga class. After an incredibly sweaty time, I would say this held up okay for me. You can see it's slightly more patchy and it's pretty revealing where I sweat, nose and general mustache area. All in all, I'm relieved we don't have to write off the sunscreen. It's a great texture. I'd give this an eight out of 10, but that's with an asterisk. It could have been higher, but for Gloria's dry skin, it actually wasn't her favorite. For skin aqua lovers, not to worry, but just make sure you rub in well. These light sunscreens are elusive. With the watery break, it makes you feel like you've spread it all over pretty quickly, but definitely would recommend to continue rubbing it in as it dries down to ensure a good, even protective film. That's it for now.